it's October 9th. It's a Wednesday. Shane and I are, uh, Shane's filming. I'm gonna shoot tonight. This will be the third night I made it out. It's been alright so far. It's a little warmer. We're basically just heading on a little travel area. There's a couple fields up on top here. They're heading to. Got a little bit of a stream there. And some higher ground here. The deer like to come right through here. So I'm using my Bob Lee signature tonight. Gold tip bears, Magnus Stinger products. I'm gonna shoot a uh, big doe tonight if we see one. Hopefully, hopefully we do. The wind's good. It's gonna cool down towards dark. Deer are gonna be moving. How long has it been since that happened? Yes, baby. I didn't <gasps> think you were gonna get a shot at it. Well, she stopped right here. She was behind that lamb. I thought I was gonna start drawing. I thought one more, and she stopped. And then she, I tried to pull back, and my arrow was lifting. I thought, I'm not gonna do that. How many? What has it been two years since we filmed each other shoot a deer? Probably. Excellent. Oh, that worked out great. She's <laughs> a big deer too. Yeah, she is. <sighs> Bag shame. No problem. That was awesome. Shaking, I'm still shaking, and I'm filming. <laughs> she stopped right. She stopped right there, and then right here, and I was like, I'll shoot down into her. I'm thinking, are you gonna shoot? And then it's like that. I tried. You know what I was waiting I go for? Back like this far, and my arrow was lifting, coming you, off my rest. You know what I was waiting for? Her look straight up at us, and right we, here when it, she smelled us. Yeah. 
Excellent. Awesome. I don't think she went very far. Do you think she died or anything? I think that she I did. I thought I saw her, like she had a long pile. It was like she rolled it. I don't know. Well, here's impact. There's something right there in that cherry tree. You have no idea how happy I am right now. I shot this deer last night, thought that I drilled her. We ran into another hunter traveling her. He said that she was still up walking around fine. He said she was bleeding pretty good. But I, uh, I, I was sick all night. I was sick this morning. Like I said, me and Shane got out of the tree right away. I thought we heard her crash. She probably ran, I'm guessing we tracked her probably 200 yards pushing it. And she's probably... I don't know, I'd say 100, 150 yards at least from where we, la where we lost blood last night. She did bed down. I, I didn't do the right thing. Probably pushed her last night. But uh, I I it's one of those things, I guess it all worked out in the end. Show you uh, an entrance and an exit wound, and then uh, I got to get back to work here. Thank Thankfully, my boss has let me off for a little bit to come look real quick. You can see right here where my arrow came out. It was a little bit of a steep angle. But right there's where I went in. Maybe a little bit back, a little bit further back than I would have wanted, but uh, I mean, it came out real good. So I'm going to get to doing all the dirty work here and I'm really freaking happy right now.